Hi everyone, this is Orchid. Today I'm doing more wall decor using Dollar Tree plates. The Furnacity um, wall decor plates are one of my favorites. They are absolutely gorgeous. They are an Italian designer. Uh, his dad was a painter who was somewhat obsessed with this opera singer's features and he would include her face in a lot of his work. The son continues to design under his father's name using her face and the plates are one of his more popular items. There are knockoffs, but there is no way I would invest in a knockoff. Um, I think these are going to be invaluable in the future. But it doesn't say I can't, you know, do a DIY trying to see how I can do this. So I'm using these Dollar Tree plastic plates. My hope is to move on to ceramic plates depending on, on how successful this is. For another plate I'm doing in this project, I'm using this shelf liner also from Dollar Tree. I love the floral print. I am also using sentiment stickers. You probably have seen this in Dollar Tree also. I'm using Mod Podge and of course you will need your sponge applicators. So with the Furnacity plates, I am going to do, I think, four designs and um, three of which I'll be using gold metallic spray. Spraying one a solid gold, one the other half. Now I found this absolutely gorgeous sister uh, picture online and I decided to use her as my muse. I printed her face with a heart over it, then I cut it out. And I'm simply just um, mod podging this onto the plate that I sprayed a um, solid gold. Simple, easy. The next one, I did half of her face dark, half white, you know, pale. And I mod podged that onto the plate that I sprayed just half gold. For this plate, I just cut these strips of vinyl, embossed vinyl, and just uh, put it right across her face. Clip away the excess. And then around the outer edge, I just ran some gold acrylic paint. I did another one using this design and I'll show you that at the end. Now for the other ones that I, I did, I am a shoe addict. I love fabulous shoes. I don't think I could handle something like this, but doesn't mean I can't look at it. So I basically mod podge this onto the plate. Then once that was dried, I put these, you know, these little sequins you get at Dollar Tree that are sticky on the back. I just put a bunch of them onto the shoe itself. Then I wanted something gold and textural around the edges, so I had some leftover Go leafing. I have a go leafing video if you want to see how that is done. Go leaf and I, we have a love hate relationship. You don't have to do this, guys. Um, takes a lot of patience, which I oftentimes don't have. You could simply spray the edge go like I did for another one of the plates. For another plate, I used the um, shelf liner. Then I um, mod podge a picture of the Eiffel Tower and then the word Paris. Now remember you to uh, smooth the um, items out and this is actually printed on regular copy paper guys. I wanted to do something in color so I found this um, pencil rendition of Beyonce in color and I am using that. I love this red. I'm not a red person but this red I can do. That orangey red. Now we know the queen bee, she's a star, so I decided to add some stars to the plate. I absolutely love giraffe prints, guys, just the design. So I had to do something like that. Mod podging that on. And then I also put some gold around the outer edge. This is what I did with the sentiment stickers simple straightforward easy now in terms of mounting the plates they are very light this is plastic you don't need to do anything special i just got the uh, foam mounting tape from dollar tree and this was perfect these hold guys make sure you put them where you want them to go and here they are now i am actually pleased with how they turned out i must say and i am inspired to move on to doing it on ceramic plates you can use your child, your pet, 
um, you know, some loved one. Um, I, 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 I really like this, guys. And um, let me know what you think. I mean, I think this woman is absolutely gorgeous. I don't know her, but um, I am going to keep these in my home. People are going to be asking me who this woman is, and I'll say it's just a beautiful sister from the Internet. Now, these are the other ones I did. Oh, I'm in love with the one with the shoe, guys. Can you Do you see that go leafing around the edge? I'm still trying to convince my mom that go leafing is absolutely gorgeous. She isn't there yet, almost a year, and she's not there yet. But I'm showing you a close-up for a reason. You see my flaw right there? Make sure you smooth the paper out when you're applying your Mod Podge. Just make sure of that. And finally, Miss Beyonce in all her glory. Overall, this project was under $10 and I still have stuff left over, you know, um, so hope you like it. Thank you so much for watching, guys. Bye now.